United Stora Slider from Trinity United Methodist Church in Milford, Ohio. I'm so glad that you're joining us today. Um, we welcome you whether you're in person with us here at church today or maybe you're joining us online during the live stream or catching a replay on one of our social media platforms. Um, we welcome you all. So today I brought a special sign. Can you guys read what it says? Are you sure you know? All right, some people see that sign and see God is nowhere. But some people look at that sign and say God is now here. All right? It all just depends on your perspective, right? Um, where do you think God is? I think that God is here at church. I think God is at your house with you um, where you're worshiping today. Um, I think a lot of people see God in nature when they see the beautiful creations that God has created all around us. Um, I see God when I see people showing love towards one another. Um, that's another way to see God in this world. Um, God is loves to be with us during our um, celebrations, but God is also with us when we're hurting and we're having a bad time. He's always with us, right? As Christians, that is very important to what we believe. We believe that God is everywhere. And though we believe that he's everywhere, sometimes you can get um, even closer to God and feel that connection even more at special times. Um, one of those times is during worship. And another time that you can feel this closeness to God is during your prayer time. But today we're going to talk a little bit about another way, and it's during Holy Communion. Okay? So, um, today is a special day in the life of the United Methodist Church. It's actually called World Communion Sunday. And this happens every um, year on October 1st, or the first Sunday of October, sorry. And... It uh, is a special Sunday. It's one of only six special Sundays in the United Methodist calendar. And on that day, they collect a special offering, and that offering goes to, to scholarships for minority groups. So it's real important. All right. So we, as a whole United Methodist Church, will uh, join together to take communion. But it's also kind of cool that a bunch of other denominations um, also celebrate World Communion Day today too. So people will be celebrating uh, communion together all around the world. And that makes it extra special today. All right. So as a reminder, Holy Communion is when we take a loaf of bread and a cup of juice. And as Jesus taught us, we're going to pray over it, right? And then we're going to break the bread and we're going to eat it, remembering that that represents uh, Christ's body that was broken for us. And then we're going to drink the drink and we're going to remember that that um, is Jesus' blood that was spilled on the cross to take away our sins, okay? And even though the bread and juice, you know, we can... it can physically sustain our bodies. The um, special eating and drinking of communion will sustain our spiritual bodies. Okay, so it's real important. All right. Um, today, as we join from people all around the world, we're going to remember that God is now here. Okay, let's bow our heads and say a prayer. Dear Lord God, we thank you so much for being here for living in our hearts and for being in this church and for dwelling with our families, no matter where we are. And even though we may not be physically together, most especially today, we thank you for being in the bread that we eat and in the drink that we drink from this holy table. Help us to see that you are now here. Make us strong by your love. It is in Jesus's name we pray. Amen. All right, at Trinity every week, we'd like to send you away with a special blessing, and I'd love for you to join with us. In all that we think, in all that we say, in all that we do, may we glorify you. God bless you all. Have a terrific day. Bye-bye.